Did you ever impress your father? You know, I, um, I think I did. Not that he would ever tell me, because when I told him I did this deal and I made a million dollars or something, he'd say, well, did you see what this guy did? He just made $20 million. He's the Mickey Mantle of real estate. And I always tell the story of where the principal called me into his office and said, you have to be one of the dumbest kids that have ever come to this school. You'll be lucky to be a shoe salesman. And with that, he threw me out of high school. The thing that I really remember about Judah the most is <laughs> how serene he is and how peaceful he is. You know, the thing is that, that Judah didn't leave. <laughs> My earliest recollection of Judah I think had to do with Rockaway. I remember my brother and I just having a hell of a, of a good time. I was born with this congenital heart defect. Well, he'll most probably make it to 20. Gone like tomorrow, put on a good show. There was light in his eyes. I think he's very proud of what he's built up. He tells us the story a lot. Close your eyes, he told me that life is a candle, no one can see. It burns in the darkness, like the light in your eyes. He's playful, he's creative, he's looking at the world differently. That's the nature of genius. When I first met Judah and he um, was telling me about the programs I was I was in. It's worth more than most people understand. He's legendary at Xavier University. He's accumulating the gift of giving. If you're lucky, you're all set. And I have been lucky my entire life. You know I knew him. I always knew him. Could never believe him. All you saw was his disguise.